is going on everyone? Hope everyone's having a great day. Jumping in today's vlog in the shop right now with Gustavo. We're getting the 335i on the lift right now. And I actually swooped a new exhaust for the, the E90. So I was talking about in the other video when I got the VRS downpipes uh, installed that I wanted to do some modifications to the exhaust, the OEM exhaust, and pretty much make it the BMW performance exhaust, which is called the PE mod. Well, I found one on Craigslist for sale, so I went and swooped it picked it up with the truck and dropped it off yesterday so now we're just getting this on the lift and this is honestly going to sound really really nice from the the modification so i'm going to show you guys just a comparison real quick of what the oem exhaust looks like so it has two and a half inch tips and then with the new exhaust we have some big old four inch tips which will sound really nice and then if I flip this over like I was saying uh, pretty much the person before me what I was going to do the OEM exhaust is cut into this muffler right here and replace the the muffler in here with a straight pipe and he also uh, deleted the cats and added some AR25 um, resonator pipes so these are going to make it sound a lot more better get her that better tone and if you guys haven't checked out the downpipe installation, make sure to go check that out. So we just got the, the rubber hangers loose. And we're just taking off one of these brackets. And pretty much it's just hanging on this bracket right here. And we'll just have to disconnect them from the, the downpipes from over there. And it should drop down pretty nicely. Alright guys, here's a quick comparison between the OEM exhaust and the modified one. Here's my cats. We have them replaced with the, the resonator pipes, the AR25s, and then you see these tiny little tips. We have them replaced with the big old four inch. And we're gonna flip this exhaust right now and I'll show you guys the welds on the other side. I guess so real quick you guys can see the welds on top of there and pretty much the guy just cut inside of these mufflers and replace it with the straight pipe and that's what's going to give us that extra nice tone just getting back the gaskets in place getting it all lined up and we just got to get the rubber hangers on and it should be all good and secured damn those exhaust tips look so much bigger than the the two and a half inch. Jeez. All right, so Gustavo just got all the exhaust bolts tightened up and the gaskets in, and now we just need to get it in the rubber hangers, and it should be a go. I can't tell you guys how hyped I am. It should be sounding really amazing. I've been looking forward to this for a while, and I'm really glad that I found one that was already just had the welds on, so that if worse comes to worse, I don't pass emissions or I don't find someone to a plug to hook me up and pass emissions I just have the OEM exhaust and we'll just swap that one out because the only uh, problem I think that I'm not gonna pass emissions is because I have the downpipes yes I have the the check engine uh, coat off because I have that DP fix which is supposed to help me pass emissions but I also remove the Cadillac converters and then also the straight pipes in here but yeah looking forward to hearing some aggressive tones some hopefully some backfires but yeah guys I'm really I'm really hyped let's get it Alright guys, so my man Gustavo is a fucking boss, so like while he's working on my car midway, he's like, alright, I gotta go sell this car real quick, so good thing I brought some little Caesars for both of us, got that, that gas pack, hold up, I hear, I hear a really good song coming. The people over there are playing speaker knockers, let's get it, RIP to the young legend. We're so close to being done. We just need to put the bracket on. But we got everything in the rubber hangers. Everything looking nice, lining up really nice. Just look at those large tips. Like, holy shit. Such a big difference in these little pinky things. Now let's hear it. Oh shit, it's time. <laughs> That sounds crazy. Hey guys, so if that exhaust clip wasn't good enough for you guys, you guys already know where we're pulling up right now. Yup, the local parking garage. 
you guys are going to for real get to hear this time and get some nice echo, hopefully some backfires. Guys, it sounds so fucking good. I was flooring it on the highway here. No drone at all. Sounds so fucking good. But yeah, I'll show you guys why it's when we pull up. Guys, so I just pulled up right now, parked in a spot. Now let's get some rest. Let's get it. I'm going to set the camera up real fast so I can show you guys. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Gang. Alright, so you guys can already tell for yourself, this exhaust sounds a thousand times better than the OEM with just the PE mod and those uh, resonators replaced with the cats. Oh my god, guys, I'm so fucking hyped right now. Like, my car just sounds like a beast. Like, literally, this is exactly how I wanted to sound like. I got the three inch VRSF down pipes connected to the resonators and then the PE mod. And oh my god, guys, this, this mod was definitely worth the money. It definitely beats buying a $1,600 exhaust. And wow. I'm really hyped. Now it's time for a tune, definitely. But yeah, I'm really stoked on how my car sounds. Absolutely in love with it. Huge shout out as always to Gustavo for helping me with the car. He always helping me with his shop. He always let me bring in the car in the shop anytime that I need it. I was telling Gustavo that I have a whole bunch of parts coming, so he's gonna be busy for the next couple weeks once the parts arrive. But um, I got more on the way, guys. New videos, more content. If you guys like the video, make sure to like and subscribe. But until next time, guys, we out here.